there's some other things that ketones do. They spare and actually can help build muscle. As we get older, after the age of 30, our muscle starts to decline. Unfortunately, it's very easy to build muscle when we're young. And then as we start to get older, muscle starts to dwindle. Well, not only is, is that bad for just walking around and functioning, but muscle helps keep us leaner. Uh, the more muscle we have, the leaner we typically are. So we want muscle. So ketones help spare and build muscle. Our research on exogenous ketones has focused on performance predominantly. So we've done a number of studies in athletes looking at their uh, ability to perform intermittent running um, protocols. So that mimics, for example, team sports like soccer. Uh, one of the more interesting findings that we had was that in what's typically seen with high intensity efforts is that uh, athletes will tend to, their cognitive function will tend to decline over the course of a, a session. And what we have seen is that that decline is prevented when ketones are added to the fuel mix. So single dose exogenous ketones will typically raise beta hydroxybutyrate levels within about 15 to 20 minutes and they'll tend to stay elevated for up to two hours. Depending on the dose, it can get you into a level of ketosis that can definitely have metabolic effects that could potentially enhance performance. What we know from looking at uh, rodent studies that have been done uh, that have looked at training, they've been able to show that in muscle, uh, after a period of training, these rodents are better able to uptake and utilize ketones. So there's definitely something going on in the periphery in terms of the use of ketones. There's, there's no doubt they can be used. Thank you.